Hey there, I'm Chris with Tutoring Services, and today I'm going to give you a brief overview of the tutoring services we offer here at PCC. We've got a lot to talk about, so let's dive right in. We're going to be answering a couple of questions today, like how does tutoring help, or what tutoring services are offered? We'll end with how to keep up with us, and how to reach out. So, how does tutoring help? Studies have shown that students that leverage academic support services do better in school, boosting their academic performance and self-efficacy, that is, their own belief in their abilities as a student. The key, then, is to start accessing these services within their first term. Those students had a higher likelihood of completing their degree or program, and it was found that there was a direct correlation between the amount of time spent in tutoring and the chance that a student would graduate. So let's go over how to actually access that tutoring. If there were one thing that I'd want you to remember more than anything else today, it's how to get to our tutoring homepage, pcc.edu slash tutoring. You can also just Google PCC Tutoring and get to the same place. Right at the top of the screen, our website includes what times we are open and what days, if any, we are closed during the term. When you're planning out your visits to the tutoring center, be sure we'll be open by checking out the Hours of Operations box. In general, our days of closure will match when the wider school is closed, such as a federal holiday. But we might be closed on other days too, so be sure to take a look. I want to show you a bit more about this page, but if you're ever lost and you aren't sure where to go, just click here on the Join Drop-In Tutoring button, and you'll be connected to the online tutoring front desk, where we will have staff available to answer your questions. Just ask. We love to help. That said, this page has a ton of information all in one place, like joining drop-in tutoring, scheduling an appointment, scheduling an appointment with the Reading and Writing Center, accessing the Western eTutoring Consortium, or using Request a Tutor. I invite you to explore this page when you have a chance. Today, we're going to focus on how to get to our schedule so you know when a tutor is available for your class. Let's take a look at an example of a schedule and what to expect. When you first come in for drop-in tutoring, expect to spend about 15 or 20 minutes with your tutor. So be sure to bring a list of questions that you want to work on. That list might include a concept you're struggling with, or it might be a literal list of problems from homework that you're working on. After your time together, your tutor will set you up in the tutoring lounge so that you have a chance to apply the skills you've practiced. After you've had an opportunity for independent work, you can always click the Ask for Help button, and the front desk can get you set up with a tutor for another 15-20 to 20 minute session. While you're in drop-in tutoring, there will often be other students present that are working on similar subjects. As a result, the drop-in tutors will rotate between students. But there's no real limit to how long you can be in the online tutoring center. Just know that the tutors are trained to help guide you through your homework, not to complete it for you. If you'd ever like to schedule a session with one-on-one -on -one support, you can make an appointment to meet with a tutor for a 30-minute block. These sessions are similarly student-led, so do still bring a list of questions that you'd like to work on. At this time, our policy limits appointments to one per subject in a single day. For example, if you're taking a math class, Math 111, and Biology 112, say, you shouldn't make two appointments for Math 111, but you could make a single appointment for Math 111 and one for Biology 112. In either case, you'll want to click the Schedule tab at the bottom of this page to view what times we have available. That schedule will look just like this example on the right. On our social media, we are excited to share study tips, keep you posted about any changes to our schedule, and to help you get to know more about our tutors. Be sure to follow us on Facebook or Instagram. On Facebook, we are portlandcc.tutoring.services, and on Instagram, we are at PCC Tutoring Services. But if you ever find yourself in a spot where your question isn't quite answered after looking around at pcc.edu slash tutoring, please send us an email at tutoring-services at pcc.edu. And that's it. Thank you for joining me today. We look forward to seeing you in the Tutoring Center.